safety for kids. Mom, it's our playtime. Can we go out and play? Into the playground? Yes, Mom. Okay, but be careful while playing. Okay, okay. bye. Bye, kids. First. I came here before you! Me first! Oops! That was a wrong choice! If you will push each other and try to rush into elevator, anyone can get injured! Well done! You made a perfect choice! We should always stand in a queue on the left side till the elevator comes and we should not play around the elevator. Already too many people inside. What are we gonna do now? Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Yay! <laughs> Sorry, that wasn't the correct option. If you try to enter the lift despite of its being full, then chances of malfunctioning of elevator due to overload increases. Done! You made a good choice! Yay! If the elevator is overloaded, you should wait till the empty elevator Yay! comes, or you should enter if there is space in the elevator. Yay! Yay! Sorry, you made a wrong choice. You might hit the passengers who are getting off. Congratulations! That's correct! When you are waiting for Yay. an elevator, stand to the left side of the doors. This will give people Yay. who are getting off plenty of space to exit. Allow everyone who Yay. is getting off a chance to exit before you board the elevator. Your foot might get stuck between the doors, and you can get injured. Yay! Oops, you made a wrong choice. You may get injured. Sorry, you made a wrong choice. Your hands might get stuck between the elevator. Congratulations! You made a perfect choice! You should always press door open button to reopen the elevator until everyone has boarded. Yay! Hmm. Oops, you chose an incorrect option. If you enter into the elevator with the bags on, it will consume more space into elevator, or it might be inconvenient for the fellow passengers. Yay! Yay! 
Congratulations! You chose a right option. If you are carrying a large bag or package, hold it on or near the floor directly in front of your feet. The bag or package will take up less space by your feet. Yay! 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 Well done! You made a right choice. You Yay. should always stand straight facing elevator's door, which won't create any Yay. trouble to fellow passengers. Hello, kids. Good morning. Oh, somebody has pressed all the buttons. Ah, uh, those naughty kids. Oops, that's a wrong one. Mm. Did you see that? The elevator has to stop mm. on every level because you pressed all the buttons. Next time, make sure you press mm. only one mm. button on which floor mm. you want to go. Mm. Well done! You chose a correct option! Press the button on which you desire to go, or else it will open up on all the levels and take more time to reach the desired level. Look what you did to elevator! You should never scribble in the elevator! It's a bad habit! We should always throw the trash into dustbin. If you spilled water inside the elevator, then anyone can get injured by the slippery floor. Good! You should always throw the trash into dustbin and should never scribble or splash water into elevator. But you should maintain the cleanliness inside the elevator. Congratulations! You made correct choice. You should always stand peacefully and make minimal noise. I'm scared! What's wrong with this elevator? Ah! I think we are in trouble! <laughs> Sorry, that was a wrong choice. You can't apply pressure with your hands to open the door. You might get hurt, or your hands might get stuck into the elevator's door. You made a wrong choice. There are lots of electric devices above the elevator. You might get an electric shock. Congratulations! You made a correct choice. You should press alarm and it will send requests for help. Oh no! Alarm button is not working! What will we do now? This is scary! Hey! I have my phone with me! Let's dial this number! Hello?
Hello? Hello? Mom, we are stuck into elevator. Can you please help us? Oh my goodness. Kids, don't worry. We'll take you out soon. Don't panic and stay calm. You will all be fine. Okay, Mom. Well done. You chose a nice option. Calling parents and informing about your situation can be helpful. Sorry, that was an incorrect option. If the door is not completely open, then you shouldn't run out, but wait till it completely opens. Sorry, that wasn't a correct option. If you try to step out, door might get closed or elevator might get stuck. Sorry, you made a wrong choice. You can't apply pressure with your hands or legs to open the door. You might get hurt, or your hands or legs might get stuck into the elevator's door. Sorry, you made a wrong choice. You can't apply pressure with your hands or legs to open the door. You might get hurt, or your hands or legs might get stuck into the elevator's door. Hey, come back! Congratulations, you made a great choice. You should stand still till the door opens completely and then get out of it carefully. You should exit the elevator without any hurry and should never run out of the elevator. Sorry, you made a wrong choice. You should always wait for the door to open properly because it may get closed down due any reason and you might get stuck. Well done! You made a right choice! You should always exit the elevator from right and allow the passengers to reboard the elevator. for you. Okay. Congratulations. You made a correct choice. If something has fallen, then let it be till the security man comes and help you to take it out. Oh no! Watch out! There's fire in the elevator! Sorry, that's a risky choice. If you're in the lift and you're between floors, then you will most likely be stuck there. Congratulations, you made a correct choice. Stairs is the best option to evacuate the building in case of fire. 